With the final two episodes right around the corner, there's really only one question on everyone's minds. Will Hayin regain her memories? Episodes 15 and 16 will deal with the fallout of her sudden amnesia after her life-saving surgery in episode 14 and Yoon Sung's efforts to make on move on her in this vulnerable state. Is there a happy ending coming? I certainly think so. Yoon Sung will achieve maximum creep mode. As Queen of Tears has progressed, we have seen Yoon Sung become more and more unhinged, and that arc will reach its logical endpoint in the final two episodes. Yoon Sung will make every effort to remove any trace of Hyun Woo from Hayen's life, so that she can't put together the lingering memories and feelings that identify her husband in her mind. Of course, we've already seen Hyun Woo on the tip of Hai In's tongue, so it's very likely that Yoon Sung's inability to con Hai In completely will tip him over the edge. I suspect this will be one of the final conflicts of the season, and an increasingly crazy and creepy Yoon Sung will have to be vanquished one way or another. Probably financially and with a right hook from Hyun Woo. Speaking of which, can Hyun Woo avoid jail time? With Hyun Woo implicated in the murder of the broker, the big question surrounding him is whether or not he can prove the murder was orchestrated by Yoon Sung and Seul Hee. Expect his to turn to the Hong family with help in this regard. Needless to say, my prediction is that this will ultimately bring about the downfall of Yoon Sung. He will be exposed as the perpetrator. Hai In will fully recall Hyun Woo, and everyone will live happily ever after. Except Yoon Sung, of course, who, again, will probably catch a right hook and a prison sentence of his own. Hyun Woo and Hai In will end up together and will get our happy ending. With Hai In, now not going to die at the end of the season, the real lingering question is whether she'll get her happily ever after with Hyun Woo. And my prediction here is pretty simple. Of course she will. This is what the whole season has been building up to, and across the course of what essentially amounts to 16 feature films, if we don't get this payoff at the end, I, and I suspect most of the audience, will be fuming. So, it's in the show's best interests for the central couple to get back together for the long haul, newly convinced of their love for each other, and with a second chance to make the most of their marriage. Don't worry, I'm like 99% confident this will happen.